in the next 90 seconds, I'm going to take you through a few positions that every good player is going to have at the top of their backswing. So first, we're going to get into our good posture. As you swing to the top, all right, a few things that we're looking for. First is going to be the, the wrist is going to be kind of flat. Okay, Some players have it cupped. Right? That usually leads to an open club face. Right? You can see how it changes my club face at the top. And then it's also bowed. That's going to be like a Dustin Johnson. That's going to be more of a closed club face. Right? But traditionally, we want your wrist to be pretty flat when you get to the top. Okay. The next point, when you get to the top, you can see where the club is. It's going to kind of hide behind my hands, just like we talked about in the takeaway. It's going to be right in front of my hands, then it's going to hide behind my hands. Okay. A lot of players, you can see that flying right elbow pushes the club across the lane. Or if the elbow is really tucked underneath, it can lead to a laid off position. We'd like to see that club hidden right behind those hands with that flat wrist. Okay, if you can keep your wrist flat, get into that good position, really turn your shoulders, everything's going to help you hit the golf ball a lot better. Okay, pay attention to those positions, pay attention to what the club face looks like at the top, and you can really start to strike the ball better. So concentrate on that flat wrist, good shoulder turn, and if you tape yourself, make sure that club looks like it's hiding behind your hands at the top of your backswing. 